Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Croatia for every... Uh, Linux for everyone. <laughs> my name's Jason. Welcome home. Welcome back to the channel. While you gaze at the shoreline of the Adriatic Sea near Camp Stupica in Croatia, I wanted to let you know that we are gradually expanding the team here at L4E in an attempt to bring you a more diverse range of content and just more great content. You may not know this, but Linux for Everyone is actually part of a larger network called the Destination Linux Network. Hopefully you got introduced to my friend Schickel on our last App Spotlight. And now I'm gonna introduce you to Matt, who is the co-host of the DLN Extend podcast and a seriously devoted Linux gamer. Anyway, I'm gonna stop blabbing as much as I'd love to show you more of this. I'm gonna get out of your hair and turn it over to Matt. You and I will talk again on the Linux for Everyone podcast later this week. All right, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and all you fine folks. Let's talk about some gaming. We're gonna be looking at five amazing games that are totally playable on Linux now because of Proton, and these require zero configuration. Zero. Enable Proton click install, click play. So let's roll into this list and get into the fun part of this video, which is the games. First game we have up is Yakuza 0. This is the beginning of the entire saga of the Yakuza games. If you want an entry point into this series, this third person action adventures, hub world, open world, free roam, brawler with a really actually pretty deep good story across the entire series this is the entry point to start at are you looking to prepare for your next evo tournament or your next fighting tournament online well here's a game recommendation for you guilty gear excerpt revelator because every single thing works out of the box multiplayer fun ranked fun smooth everything just works works it's amazing it's awesome i love it and as you can tell from the gameplay here this is totally up my alley and they vibe smooth graphics great music to go with it it's just i love this game and everything works out of the box next up we go in a completely different direction let's look at tales of Berseria. you want your jrpg you want your deep story you want your deep battle system you want anime inspired character designs and a very, very dark, and I mean dark, story, but with a hint of hope and character progression as you go through it. This is the game for you. Totally love this game. I cannot say enough about this. This is probably one of the best JRPGs I've played in a long, long time, and I've played a lot of them. So do yourself a favor and go get this game. So continue along that Japanese role-playing game route. Let's look at another one that has a very big draw from Dark Souls. A Souls-like game, shall we say, as they are called. And that is Code Vein. Code Vein is a character creator's dream. The character creator alone is amazingly fun to use. The anime-inspired storyline is actually really good. You're basically vampires. But in the Dark Souls game, it's really cool. If you want that and that type of Dark Souls heavy or focus oriented combat, definitely worth getting. Really fun game. Everything works. Multiplayer. Graphics look great. Sound is good. Just another game I really, really love. Go get this game. All right. And for those that want something just a, a wee bit different, just a little, this one's going to require you to go do some hunting. Not just in your soul, but to actually find the damn game. This is Transformers War for Cybertron. If you want your Transformers, if you have been watching the next Netflix show, this game accompanies that so well. But good luck finding it. But here's a challenge for you. It works perfectly well on Proton. Go find it. Price might be a bit high, but I'm going to say it's worth it. So there's your five game recommendations. Now, instead of spending time configuring games, you have time to go play them. So go play these five and many, many more that'll be coming down the line. I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Peace.